Cody. Yes? We're playing Mega Man. Mega Man? We're playing Mega Man. So, <laughs> Mega Man is yes. one, one of my all-time favorite series of games. One, because there's a lot of them. Two, because it's fucking awesome. And because you have a fetish for blue robot children? No. Uh, oh, okay. I mean, I uh, fetish... <laughs> Proclivity, maybe. Fetish is a bit strong. I wouldn't say fetish, but <laughs> definitely proclivity for sure. All right. So this is the stage select screen in Mega Man. Every Mega Man has one of these. Um, mm -hmm. it's, it's not a true overworld, but it kind of is. It allows you to pick what enemies you want to go after first. And which enemy you beat first determines what weapon you get, obviously, and then uh, what weakness the next enemy has. You know, uh, you so, want... So... so it's a preferential, like, to pick the right one first. Is that pretty much... Exactly. I mean, you can do it in whatever order you want, and some people do, but uh, just for ease of, of, of playthrough, we'll do it in order of weaknesses. So we'll do Gutsman first. Um, obviously, you don't have any weapons, so you're going to have to use your basic weapon on him. I got to say that I, I like that all the characters were named by the uh, by the dude from the big Lebowski. Le oh, <laughs> right? No, man. It's, it's a Gutsman, man. <laughs> no, it's Cuts, man. I, I think... I think Gutsman, I think it should have been like Strength Man or Muscle Man or something like that because he's an industrial loader robot. Like he's supposed to lift boulders and, and shit like that. He's got guts. Yeah, he's like a bulldozer. So maybe like Dozerman or something. It is a bad translation. They're all based on um, industrial robots. You've got the, the heat robot that like bends metal. You've got the ice robot that does ice things. <laughs> The bomb he does robot ice was, he does ice things. The bomb robot what blows things up. Um. So um, yeah, these levels are actually pretty short. Um, all things con considered, um, the the major uh, stumbling blocks in these levels are just falling to your death. The enemies in them aren't that tough. Interesting. So you could see they're all themed. This one is a a pick thrower. A, a a hard hat and. Uh... This is a work site. Exactly. It's very, very dangerous. A non-OSHA compliant work site. Oh, absolutely. Oh. No one's, no one's using fall protection. Nope. Well, they are wearing helmets though. Yes, which is nice. Yeah. Did you have that? Shit. The, uh, the graphics on this are really clean. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, they, uh, they did a good job because they just kind of focused in. Um, now, oh shit. I hate those big stompers. You can kind of trick them if you jump early. You can make them jump high. I just didn't jump early enough. So what are these little hard hat guys called? Um, yeah, one up. They're called hard hat gi. What? Oh, I don't know. Hold on. I no, let me get out the manual, dude. Sorry, What's buddy. up? Sorry, I, I was. I'll just uh, farm these guys here for a second because um, this is another trope in Mega Man games is. Uh, when you leave the screen, uh, enemies reappear because they have like kind of static spawn points. Gotcha. So you can just run back and forth and just kind of farm guys. And any enemy can drop any power up. They could drop one ups, life up, anything. So you find a place well, like this, you can just go back. And the uh, little hard hat Heidi guys mm -hmm. are called Mets. Mets? Yes. Okay. Get Mets. It okay. pays. Uh, and then the uh, toothy robots. Our bleeders. Oh, okay. They come back a lot. They're assholes. I think they're in just about every level. All right. Um. It, yeah. Uh, Cutsman, Gutsman, and Alekman. Yeah. So, I don't want to hear any shit about cheating to defeating, because this is gonna go a lot smoother this way. But there's a there's a trick in this first Mega Man, where if you pause the game, so enemies are invincible for a second after they get hit. But if you pause and unpause, that invincibility uh -huh. goes away. So I'm able to hit him like three times where I'd only normally be able to hit him once. Uh -huh. so, so cheating and defeating. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> no, I, I think you I think you are hearing it. I don't want to hear it. That's what I said. It's called that's, it's called that's dominant strategy, and I will, use it. <laughs> I will use I will use the dominant strategy. As, as president of the United States, I will not cheat or defeat. I will use dominant strategy, yep. which may seem a lot like cheating. Enemies. To defeat our enemies. Yay! We did it! We beat a thing! And I didn't even die one time. 
And it's over. Well, thanks for joining us for Mega Man 1. Uh, next week, we'll do Mega Man 8. C Cody, there's more. How many Mega Mans are there? A lot. Um, there's like 10, and then they get into the X series, and there's like like eight, like seven or eight or something in the X series. There's a lot. Jeez. We're going to do them all. All, all right. Mega Mans. Because uh, Mega Man it, uh, Collection this is, this just is, came out. This is cute, man, right? This is cute, man. He's, mm -hmm. He's cute. No, they missed an E. It, it was a typo. It is cute, man. It's cute, man. He's uh, in his pink outfit. Mm hmm. He's pretty cute. There's a fucking bladers again. And the, uh, the this level is themed to uh, mint chocolate chip ice cream. Yes, it's delicious. Oh, so I got gutsman power. So this is this is how this works. I can pick up bricks. <clears throat> Whoa. Yeah. <clears throat> it's actually super helpful later on, but uh, the power is kind of useless on its own because you need bricks around to actually right. use it. <clears throat> Oh, I want to say one thing about these bladers. I love them because they look like, they do look like they're toothy monsters, and they're like, hello. Yeah, and this. Mm, yes, I'd like to it's bite cool you, design. please. Yeah. Which I believe has been stolen by other things since this. The big that toothy thing? Like a, yeah, it seems like a very familiar. I don't know if it's supposed to be teeth. I think it's supposed to be like a rim of metal or something. I think it's just, you know, limit, limited sprite design. Ooh, sprite sounds delicious. Right, 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 right. Oh yeah, they, they don't. They really. They don't look specifically like teeth in the in the in the Manuel. Yeah. Um, probably like blades. Um, what's it? Uh, speaking of sprites, so Mega Man is blue for a very specific reason. Uh, it wasn't a design choice on purpose. It well, it was, but um, he's blue because he um, the limited NES color palette. There's supposed to be more. I think there's like five blues in the NES color palette. And they okay. wanted a very detailed sprite, <clears throat> so they chose blue because they'd be able to see. Look, you can do his boots, and he has his little underwear. So right. you can do more. You know, it only looks like they're using two of the blue, but they. Probably... But they can use. But they can use other blues because the background's kind of. Exactly. Uh, is the background the same color as his? I think body? it's. I think it is. Yeah. Yeah. God, but see, that's why. Ha that's why having a nice outline, though, because I, I think a yes. lot of games don't have that solid mm -hmm. outline. And that's yeah. why they're not as clean. Like yeah. that black outline really, it, also, it, it, it separates him from the background, you know? I mean, look at his look at his walk animation. First of all, he's like, his walk animation is fucking awesome. He's like, on, he's power walking. And then True. he has his jump, yeah. and then he has jump and shoot, and he has his shoot. Like he has a lot of different sprites compared to like other games like Legend of Zelda and stuff who only really have a couple. So yeah, they did a really good job and it just br ties it all together. Another yeah, thing. I'm Another Unlike that poser, Legend of Zelda. Oh, like look, he even has a crawling animation, and then he had the the falling animation when we were fighting Guts when he was jumping on the ground. He had that like stun, and he only oh, yeah. does that in that fight, I think, when he's fighting Gutsman, where he like falls oh, on the wow. ground. So like they really, they went overboard on his sprites, which is awesome. Which, which is fitting since the game is called Mega yeah, Man, right? That Mega Man would actually be decent. Well, the thing too, I mean, like like Metal Gear Solid, like or not Metal Gear Solid, but just Metal Gear. Like, think of Snake. Like, he's got his like punch and his shoot, and that's it. Like, he doesn't have right. very much going on there, and his sprite is very dull. The, the outline is thin. It's not, it doesn't pop at all. In this, yeah. it's almost like Mega Man is like the main attraction, and he's just kind of going through these. I, I don't want to say dull levels because they're pretty filled with shit, but he definitely is the main. The main there is, there, it seems like there is something lacking though, as far as like danger and whatever that mm. you, as you go through these. Oh well, that's only because I'm fucking awesome. Oh, is that you, what it you is? Just even when I started practicing, I was falling and dying. There's spikes. You're, you're, yeah. you're, you, you've taken all of the suspense out of it yeah. by being awesome. Sorry, folks. Yeah, and I'm not. I mean, I never beat Mega Man One. I think I beat Three. Was the only one I really beat when I was when I was younger. So I'm looking forward to this. I wonder if does the same asshole Shit. do all of these levels by putting random spikes places? Because I, I swear yeah. there's no place else in the world yeah, where right? they just Re randomly bust up a floor and throw in some like fucking punji spikes. Yeah. Punji spikes. I think, you know, if they really wanted to keep me out, they would just do the whole floor in spikes. Yeah, the whole place would just be spikes. Yeah. So I think, I think Dr. Wily, I think he's, uh, there's a little bit of, uh, what is it, um... Your uh, your lips say no, but your uh, your stage design oh, says wow. yes. Wow! <laughs> I, I didn't realize that was a thing that people said, but 
<laughs> your lips say yes. no, but your stage design says yes. So Gutsman is super weak to um, or uh, Cutsman is super weak to Gutsman power because you know Rock beats scissors. Um, um. <laughs> Rock does beat scissors. Yeah. You made short work of cute man. Yep. And I like it ends with him like in yeah. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I did it. I did let's, it. I beat him. Let's let's end on a jump, yay.